everybody needs a shave today, but we are track packaging. To, uh, we're tracking packages today, uh, basically. But uh, as far as we know, uh, basically, uh, the package that we were supposed to get Friday, hopefully we're supposed to get today, because today is Monday, uh, March 26th. And uh, we got one package already a week early. Uh, it's not the one we, it's a week, uh, almost going to be a week late, uh, basically. We got two packages coming. Uh, one has just arrived today, and Angie's waving in my face. What do I have to do? Do I get it? I got to go out to that box again. Let me go with you this time? Ah. Uh, yeah, I'll let her do it today. Let's do it. All right, just let uh, explain this a little bit better. Is one of our subscribers was supposed to send us a package from Canada, and right now, as of this video, it is still in Hopkins, Illinois. We'll find out where it's at towards the end of this video, so we won't end this video right away. Yeah. So I want to close out the video, find out where that Canada package is, uh, where it's at. But the... Uh, the charger for the camera has arrived today. Uh, we found that out officially through Amazon. And we got to go out get that meal key that we just wave. Yeah, and she's got it in her hand. We got to go out uh, to the other side of the property to those silver boxes and pick it out, right? Yeah. And pluck it out on that, okay? Yes. All right, let's go do this. Okay. Let's go do this. Okay, it's this box, right? Yep. And there it is, right there. That's there a big box. That's a big, big, big box. United Road of Transport Package Damage. Okay. And the key stays there. Okay. okay? That was for sure. Alright, yeah, key stays there. Okay, right now, Angie can't wait to see what we got in the box. Let's see what this is. Of course I know what it is. It's a charger that I ordered on Amazon. Look at that. Hopefully the charger. Ah, uh, paper. <laughs> uh, there it is. Ooh, battery plus charger. So we got a backup battery to this camera right here. Woohoo! That's why it's worth uh almost almost fifty bucks. But I was able to save ten dollars off the price because I forgot to tell you guys the other day when I ordered this I had my Bing Awards. Uh, I had enough points built up on my Bing searches. So I don't use Google search. I use Bing as B-I-G-N. Uh, when I search online I sign up for Bing and I did a video on this uh, a couple years ago how you collect Bing Awards. That's how I was able to get that one video where we did your haircut and I had an 87 cent lunch. You did, so I didn't go with you. And that. So, uh, right now we're going to open this box up. Actually, let's open it up right now. Okay, uh, let's just carefully open this up so we don't uh, tear it. Should open up nicely. Bunch of pamphlets, wow. All kinds of pamphlets, accessory kit, kits, everything. So, keep the box aside. Angie, your favorite bubble wrap. And what this is, right here, is here's your charger cord. And what it does is it's supposed to, after you get done charging, it's supposed to slide. Yep, it slides. There's it, the other yep, battery. There's the other battery. So it slides out. And your battery should come out easily just like this. Your battery should come out easily like that. So this is our other backup battery to this camera. Whoops, I actually dropped it. Right now, let's go ahead, let's let this thing warm up to air temperature. Uh, basically, it is cold in here, so we don't want to charge it right off the bat. You could ruin it. And uh, 
this battery is about half charged. We'll explain why we're going to use this instead of using the other cord to charge up uh, the battery that you seen in the video the other day. I think it was yesterday's video, I believe. I'm not for sure. Maybe the other day's video. Uh, I showed you how we actually charge it through either the other charger or how we plug it into the thing. Uh, right now, this will avoid all that issues, and we'll have a backup fully charged battery from now on. Yes, about yes, time. I'm so this back. camera will be prolonged at least a few more years. Is that good news or what? Yes. The the bad news is we're still waiting for our Canadian package as of right now. We're going to find out later in this video. Uh, is it left Hopkins, Illinois, or is it going back to Canada for some reason? I don't know. Uh, we had a comment saying it's got to be Timmy's, so if it's Timmy's, it's got to be good. Alright, since I uh, did not include one of these, we got so many of these lying around the apartment, so we'll just go ahead and we'll plug it in, and we'll plug it into a socket, okay? Uh, we'll charge up the other battery, and I uh, will show you... Uh, through the cell phone camera, uh, I can't really do this uh, one way or another, but we'll get it uh, plugged in. And uh, let me do this off camera and all that stuff. We'll we get our cell phone camera out like this, and uh, we'll show you how we install a freshly charged battery to this camera that I'm filming currently right now. Okay, we'll just plug it in right there. And we're trying to set this. There's the yellow light right there. That yellow light will indicate it's charging. It should turn green when it's fully charged. We'll check on it in a couple hours, okay? Okay, I'm having my uh, Tim Hortons here. Angie's going to have hers. I just emptied oh, this. No. Just emptied this can, yeah. No. What? Oh, it's okay. I got two cans left. You got two? Four cans left, and we don't know about the mystery package. I just so, finished the book one from the wall, guys. Yeah, that was the walls. Uh, thank you very much on that. So we got two more cans, and we got something coming from Canada. We're still waiting on that package. Uh, I have not done that update yet. Uh, we're going to check on the battery charger a little bit here. Uh, this camera is probably going to go dead. Yeah, I'm going to... Angie's gonna have fun and all that stuff. What? Yeah, the very expensive bubble wrap. Unless, you, unless you buy a, a whole big thing of bubble wrap. We're not gonna do it. <laughs> no. We're <laughs> not gonna do it. Mm -mm. Okay, let's check on the battery charger here. Check it on the battery charger. Still a yellow light. We'll come back on it, see if it turns green or a different color or goes or goes flat out out. If it does, that means it's fully charged. Save. I finally shaved. Looks good and handsome. Okay. All right. Uh, let's go check the battery charger on this thing, and uh, let's see what it looks like because it was lit yellow, and it looks like we got no light. That means one thing. It should be charged right now. Since this battery's about dead. Let's go ahead, we'll switch over to the cell phone camera. I'll show you how we're going to switch batteries real quick. And we'll have a fully charged battery. And we'll charge up this battery on the Sony cam. And we'll have a backup full power battery from here on out until this camera lasts. What do you want, fishies? What do you want? What do you want? You notice since I moved the fish tank over here, Opal's been acting a lot better. Opal hasn't been leaning. Yeah, has not been in the funk. Uh, been acting like a normal fish over here. I guess she just wanted new scenery. Uh, there she is. There she is. That's Opal right there. Camera shy. Okay, what we did was, uh, yep, and she's playing the game in the background. Okay. All we have to do is just slide this, open this up, slide it out, and the battery will come out of this. Uh, not as easy doing one hand, but that's the backup battery. That's the battery that came with the charger. I could not believe that, but it is. It did. That's why you pay the price uh, for that. So right now, let's get this battery. Let's get this battery in this camera, and we'll have a fully charged uh, camera uh, finally.
Okay, we're going to take the battery out here. I just got to slide you guys over a little bit, okay? Looks like the uh, thing is just off-center somewhat. Okay, uh, one thing is, uh, how do we upload the videos? Before we take out the battery, how do we upload the videos uh, without using this anymore? Well, we have not used this for a long while. We've been using this for until it finally snapped uh, somewhat. Uh, you have to really had to put, if you want to charge it, you really had to hold it in the right location and plug it into a backup, uh, the other charger that I showed you the other day, or to the cord, but it, it will not go yellow anymore. So that's why we ordered this uh, new charger uh, thing right now. So how we upload the videos, uh, basically what we did was we take, we open up the camera, we open up uh down here and just push in the micro mini uh, card right here and we put it into this little adapter here and we put it in the computer that's how we upload or upload the videos to our computer right now we've been doing that since uh, on the same side since uh, July of last year uh, basically uh, because uh, I had a feeling that the cord was going to go out on me in a way, so we just kept it for plugging into a charger, uh, one of those plug-in chargers to the outlets uh, down here by the by our computer down here on the floor, and that. So what we do is we open up the back end right here. We open up the back end. Don't worry about this blue thing. I don't think this blue thing ain't gonna wear out anytime soon because we're gonna be starting using it from now on by open this up. The battery will come out of there, and we will switch, uh, oh, just to let you guys know, uh, two batteries, okay? We'll put the other battery in, we gotta make sure the arrow is pointing towards the, we gotta make sure this arrow is pointing out towards this blue thing right here to let us know it is in correctly. So that's it. Slide the cover back on, and should be voila. We should have full power right there. If you can barely see it, okay. And we do have full power on that. So what we do with this almost dead battery? What we do is, uh, like I said, just opposite of what we did earlier. Put it in. Slide the door, and we put uh, our USB cords to it. Actually, I think you could use almost any USB cord if you want, but we have not tried it yet. So I'll let you guys know on that phase. Okay, so uh, we'll go ahead. Uh, since now we will have a fully charged camera with a backup battery. We'll carry this case with us uh, in a way with the battery inside of it to protect it uh, in a way from other elements. And we will have uh, a backup battery at all times in case one goes dead while filming out on town or out of town or wherever. Or like at a sporting event. Or a sporting event or whatever we allow to take this camera in. Okay? So we'd be good to go. Uh, finally, we should have done this on our Cena Point trip. would have been a lot easier. And it would have been safe because we had to use that charger, plug it in. It would have saved this cord if we didn't have, if we would have had this back in 90, no, I mean 96, back in 2016 on our Cedar Point trip, we would have saved this cord, uh, I would say, uh, extra lot longer than what it has been. But we're good to go. This video is getting too long. Uh, before we check out, uh, before we close out the show, we're going to make one last update in about a couple hours, maybe about three or four hours from now. We'll close out the show, we'll be the next clip, and find out where that Canadian package is at. I was saying Hopkins, but it's actually pronounced Hopkins, not Hopkins, Hopkins. That was where the package was at as of this clip, as of uh, right now, whatever the time it is, 4 o'clock. Uh, it should be loading up to the next truck for its final destination before delivery. I'm hoping tomorrow we get it. It's too long. I can't wait for it. Angie can't wait for it. Right now, we'll be right back. Later tonight, uh, for us about maybe around 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock, uh, we'll close out the show for you guys to be the very next clip.
Okay, it's a few hours later. Angie just went to bed. She's she usually gets up pretty early anyway. Yeah, she went to bed early because she usually gets up early. I usually stay up till about midnight or 1 a.m. and all that stuff. Right now, let's go ahead and close out the show on the situation of this one last package. Uh, here's the situation it's in. And boy, what a storyline it tells you right there. <laughs> yeah. Last known destination right there. I actually called it earlier in the video Hopkins. It's called Hodgkins, uh, basically. And that's where it's at as of that day. And this is the 26th of March. I'm filming this. Uh, we'll find out tomorrow. Uh, right off the bat. And, and that's how we're going to start tomorrow's video. Just find out where that Canadian package is at. It's supposed to be in Davenport. On its way to Davenport right now. But it's not. Uh, basically, it's still stuck somewhere in Illinois. And that's so... Uh, uh, one thing we did like is the the new charger with the cord. Of course, the plug-in was uh was our own. Uh, we had to find out we had to because it didn't include a plug-in. That's the only thing bad about it. But it came with this and the charging unit plus extra battery. We like that because it's right now we got the charge battery on this camera, and I just got done charging the original battery that came with this camera, uh, basically. So I got two full charge batteries as of right now, and that. So we're good to go, uh, basically. Uh, just when I upload videos, I have to take the, the small uh, micro uh, SD card out to put it in this adapter. I put it on the computer, and we upload videos that way so I can edit them, render them, and you get to watch our sad little stories of the day and that. So right now, since Angie's already in bed, she can't close the show, so I'll close it out. Please like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It would help us out big time. And we'll see you next time. Bye.